Hi, it's Deacon Dawn here again today and uh, for my next vlog. As you can see, I'm, um, well, maybe you can't, I'm in the sanctuary, but it looks very, very different now. Um, it's all ready and set up for um, Sleeping Beauty, our pantomime um, with the Lantern Arts Centre this week. Uh, we had opening night last night, which went really, really well after lots and lots of rehearsals and dress rehearsals. And um, I'm backstage crew um, for the whole week, which is really good and really interesting to see um, how, um, when you sit in an audience, sometimes you don't realise the phonetic work that goes on behind the scenes. So it certainly opened my eyes to, uh, to what the crew get up to. And that got me thinking really about um, our lives and during Advent and thinking about the support that we need because that's what the crew do. The crew are behind there, supporting the actors, getting them changed, um, making sure their cues are on time, making sure they have the right props when they need it and, uh, and ensuring the smooth running of the performance. So what you see in front is uh, um, the smooth finished product and behind the scenes there's lots of things going on to enable that smooth finished product. So how do we at this time in, in, in Advent actually, what are our crew members? That really, that really got me thinking about that. Um, you know, what if you could name your crew members, maybe their support network, your family, your friends. Um, so you have crew members that just help you, do you know what, get through the life, get through the season and things like that. But it's not just people that can be our crew members as well. Our supporting crew actually can be how kind we are to ourselves. They can be um, things that we do to look after our, ourselves at this time when it's really busy. Um, taking time out to read a book, not because you have to, but because you want to. Taking some time to sit and just have a cup of coffee and relax and not be feeling guilty about you know, what you should be doing. I've been reading um, Richard Raw, um, Advent for Christmas and, and thinking about this time of Advent. And he stated in there yesterday that we've become human doings, not human beings, because we just don't allow ourselves to be anymore. We measure our success on what we do, not who we are. And that seems a real shame actually because it would be really nice to think that, you know, we are human beings. It's about who we are, not what we can accomplish and not what we can do. We are already enough. And that's a really, really nice thing to think about at this time when it's, it's just so busy. You're thinking about Christmas presents and have I done this? Is the list right for the food? And have I completed all that I needed to complete? Instead of just being you and allowing this time to to really speak to you. And that's the crew members that we can take with us. The thoughts, the good things that we know we should be being, you know, rather than the doing side of everything. I still haven't figured out all of who my crew members are in terms of things. I know that they include meditation, they include prayer, they include being kind to myself, having a glass of wine in the bath. They're the crew members that we need in our lives to help us and support us to get through as well as our family and friends. So this is all for today and uh, I shall give you another update um, towards the end of Advent as we move into um, the Christmas season. So take care. God bless.